point na big deal lahat. Kasi what deal or kahit ano doon task lang yun, focus kami, ganun. Pero wala. Yung iba kasi feeling ko, mas nagiging intense yung reaction ng fans. Kaya mas nagiging intense yung isang bagay. Pero sa loob, yeah. wala talaga. Kaya nagul- yung gulat namin paglabas namin na, hala, big deal yun. Ganun. Yeah. Um, meron ako nakitang questions. Um, anong masasabi ka sa mga bashers ko? Actually, question yun for the both of us, Mika. Um, what can you say about your bashers? Ako? I don't Ewan ko ah, parang hindi ko lang talaga magets kung bakit nag invest sila ng sobra. Just to hate. Eh, wala naman lang pake. <laughs> sila lang din napapagod. So lang, thank you then sa attention nyo, sa time nyo, sa energy nyo. Pero wala eh, I know myself. Parang hindi mo naman pwedeng sabihin sa akin kung sino ako kasi kilala ko. So yun lang, thank you. Thank you sa dagdag sa one hours ng vlog ko. <laughs> Pero dead man lang talaga. Ikaw, what can you say? Um, I think, parang nung ng bahay. Ang initial reaction ko is gulat talaga. Hindi siya, I wasn't hurt, I wasn't offended. Pero sobrang iba talaga sa bahay. As in, sobrang iba. And, um, so ang masasabi ko lang about sa bashers is um, I, like, I'm not really offended. Kasi alam ko naman talaga yung nangyari sa loob ng bahay ni Kuya. And like, I've never said that I was perfect. I've never said that I was like the best housemate. I literally just did what I wanted to do, which was to play like, and when I say play the game, I mean like the actual task and the actual challenges. Yeah. Apart from that, I just live normal, yeah. like as normal as possible sa loob ng bahay ni Kuya. So yung mga sinasabi sa akin ng mga tao, like negative comments and hateful comments, it doesn't really get to me because I know the truth and I know myself. And um, I think more than anyone, sa mga, mga bashers, sa mga hindi sumusuporta, sa mga nagbibigay ng negative comments, um, feeling ko naman mas kilala ko yung housemates kesa sa inyo. Because we lived together, like I lived with them for two and a half months. So, I mean, that's all I'm gonna say about that. Um, so pra nakaka mind blowing then na meron na kung supporters and meron na kung I have supporters and bashers alike. Like, who am I? So, pra ba ko parang bakit bakit galon investor? Hindi lang overwhelming talo guys. So pra na mimis judge ng karamihan ta ng mga kar mga tao si Alisa talaga. Nung nababasa ko yung iba parang alam din naman sa ganto and trust me, I lived with her talaga. Kahit Hindi man kasing tagal nung ibang housemates, pero I lived with her. Yun din sinasabi ni Justin eh. So, may... so yun, yun talaga guys. And wala, wag, wag kasi, ang bitis kasi mag sa mga tao, isang mali lang. Mayroon mang perfecto sa atin. Uh, hmm. Tapos nitong show, or alam ko naman, like, <laughs> let's address the album. I think yung, like, issue kay L is the biggest, is still the biggest. Um, Let's just wait until the show finishes or when it's out of the house when she's ready to talk about it. I just, it would be interesting what she's going to say about it. What I know, so pag ko kay Ella, she, she would just tell the truth of what was up. Kasi kung, if, yeah, kasi kung tatanungin niya siya, and if she's going to, parang, inanarate niya kung anong nangyari sa bahay, sasabihin niya rin sa inyo na hindi talaga ganun ka-intense. So, hintayin na lang natin. Hindi talaga. Hintayin na lang natin ang nangyayari in the next few weeks kasi, I think the journey is about to finish. I'm not sure. Um, Siyempre, pa konti na ng mga housemates sa bahay, so we can just assume na malapit na ang big night. But we don't know for sure. Um, so, ano nakakita Feb 12? Ano ayun? February 12, 2021. I think yun yung usapan namin ni Chico. Kung hindi siya na-air, kung hindi siya, kung wala siya sa stream, maybe I'll tell you guys when she comes out of the house. Ano sa ngayon? You guys hanging? Kung ano man yung meron sa 12th of February 2021. Bakit? Obviously. Parang, uh, parang nabasa nito before. Um, obviously, it was in the past. Nandun pa ako sa bahay nun. I think that was two days before my eviction. Um, yun. Meron, last, last question, 9.05 na. But my favorite, I don't have a favorite Bible verse because I don't read the Bible. I'm not very religious. Um, that's that. Pero guys, alam nyo, can I share sa kanila? Yeah. Yun? I'm kong nominated. First time oh, kong yeah, nominated noon, tapos parang nag-pray kami ni Alisa. Ay, ang tagal niyang hindi nag-pray ata. Can I share this? Talaga. So yun na nga, sobrang touching lang na nag-pray siya with me and for me nung time niyan. Sobrang nakakaiyak talaga. Sumiyak kami na. Wala, nasa kwarto kami. <laughs> hindi ko alam kung na, na, na pakita yung TV, but um, yeah, that was a very emotional Sorry. for like so many reasons. Um, but yeah, like, yun yung, yun yung first time ko na nag-pray in a very long time. And I think yung start ng prayer ko is, um, 
I know I haven't spoken to you in a while. Oh, Tapos sobrang yuck na. Wala ko talaga, solid. Yeah, so, mga, siguro yun yung mga moments sa bahay ni Kuya na hindi napakita na it would have shown me in a different light. Kasi yung perception talaga ng tao sa akin is sobrang nakakagulat. Pero kasi, I know what I got myself into to this extent, but whatever, whatever. I mean, like, people, not not everyone's gonna love you. Not everyone is going to be your supporter, so. I'm just grateful sa mga taong, nanood itong live stream na to, sa mga taong sumuporta sa akin sa journey ko sa bahay ni Kuya. Kay Mika din, sa lahat sa amin, sobrang thank na sa investment niya sa amin, hindi lang sa, basta sa, sa emotional investment, sa um, financial investment din, sa time, sobrang sobrang, <laughs> sobrang sobrang thank you talaga sa lahat-lahat ng sumuporta and sumubaybay sa journey namin sa bahay. Sana patuloy niyo pa rin suportahan yung mga housemates na nasa loob ba kasi um, kahit hindi nila alam na nandun kayo, paglabas nila, alam ko sobrang-sobrang ma-appreciate nila kayo. And yun lang, sobrang nakakahambol din itong experience na to. Mga, yung mga nababasa ko mga messages nyo, especially the positive ones, very humbling. Um, I don't know what I did to deserve you guys. Alam ko si Mika, ganun din yung sentiment. Hindi ko talaga alam ako para ma-deserve yan, pero okay, go. Exactly. Kahit, um, kasi at the end of the day, all we did was live in a house and play some games. Um, pero so, grabe yung mga... Yung, yung support na, ginaw, na binibigay niya sa amin. So, sobrang salamat talaga. Kahit sa live stream ko pa lang, I mean, 1.1 million in an hour and a half. Like, that is mind-blowing. I don't know what I did to deserve you guys. Pero, thank you. Super, super deserve mo. Yung 1 million diamonds. I swear. Thank you. Hindi ko, hindi ko nakala na abot ako sa 1 million. Pero, yung mga, meron akong mga solid, solid, solid na friends na supporters. Si Janice, si Pat, um, si Leah, si Leia. Mm -hmm. Tapos, meron din mga tao dito sa bahay na ano, <laughs> na kinutukot like nila na sa sila din daw ganun pero yun yun lang naman thank you um I will let you guys go sana nag enjoy kayo sa live stream ko kahit sobrang sobrang ano um disorganized ang live stream ko pero nag, sobrang nag enjoy talaga ako um atin nung na nominate ka nung una 5 million diamonds oh my god thank you so much I didn't even know um sobrang thank you talaga as in mind blowing yung yung support niya sa akin um First housemate that had 1 million diamonds. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank you. Pero, yun nga, I hope that you guys enjoyed this live stream. Kung, um, thank you for having me. Thank you, Mika. Um, guys, I um, leave, uh, I leave you alone to thank your followers. Tell them, tell them about your socials first. Ayan. Okay, guys, follow nyo din ako sa Kumu, Mika PBB. My Twitter is I am Mika Pajares, and my Instagram is Mika Pajares. And follow me, I... Ayan, subscribe din kayo sa YouTube, Mika Pajares. And yan, abangan nyo, baka may vlog kami sa Thursday. Pero hindi sa Thursday i-upload, syempre. Mag-vlog lang, if matuloy. Which is, hopefully, hopefully talaga. Malaking-malaking yung chance na matuloy. Pero yun lang. See you soon, Alisa. Thank you for having me. Bye!